Hey guys, Reggie here. In this video, I want to share with you that I recently launched my How to Get Started in a UI UX Design free ebook, which you can find in the link in the description. And I just want to talk a moment about how to actually get into this field, which uh, I've been a part of in the past decade. So let's jump on my computer and let's talk about uh, what are the best strategies and the roadmap in order to make the most uh, as a design student in 2024. Okay, so we're here in Figma of uh, the actual ebook. Uh, and uh, what I want to talk about uh, is uh, how I break down uh, the ebook, but most importantly, how you can make uh, the best out of uh, your educational journey if you're getting started in UI UI in 2024. So initially I just cover what are the main building blocks that you want to learn about such as design theory, user experience design and trying to learn about all of the basics of both design and also user experience and psychology and generally speaking one word of advice is if uh, you focus on uh, graphic design or web design initially, UI UX is simply going to become a much easier transition. And uh, that is actually the exact same path that I took initially. So you can actually get started with uh, things which are somewhat uh, easier. Because for example, if uh, we talk about uh, web design, there is uh, less uh, complicated elements within a website. A landing page is going to follow some basic cardinal rules and when it comes to UI UX there's a lot of much more complexity that is being added on the plate. So if you have a background in graphic or web design that is actually a great place to start but if you're starting entirely from scratch my recommendation is uh, to get the design foundation uh, going uh, and that can be a graphic design course or a web design course uh, and uh, try to learn about typography, color theory, uh, layout, uh, grids, uh, all of the basics uh, which are going to lay the foundation of your UI UX design journey. And uh, right after that, uh, my recommendation is to actually go into things like uh, user experience design, learning a, a bit about psychology and even marketing to some degree because uh, that is going to essentially consolidate the higher level picture. So the design uh, basics, uh, the design foundations uh, are going to help you actually execute upon the job. But uh, things like user experience design psychology and even some marketing and business are going to help you become a strategic player. So when it comes to UI UX design, you always want to have a high level understanding of why you're creating the solution that you're creating and why it's important for the business because the reality is that this is not a field in which you create good looking designs just for the sake of it. Adding professionalism and uh, making a design pixel perfect uh, can definitely help within the user experience. But what is most important is to really focus on uh, the why and uh, what is important for the user so that then you can create the solutions which are going to enhance their user experience and make uh, the product valuable for them. So that is going to be an important element and that is the reason why I talked about this so much. Right after that uh, there's going to be the design tools which uh, is something that uh, usually designers overly fixate on and don't get me wrong I have entire courses on uh, design tools such as uh, Figma, Framer and I'm a big proponent of uh, mastering those tools because it's just going to make your life so much easier and uh, you're going to become an extremely efficient designer which uh, is going to be super important especially if you're going to become a freelancer in the future so if you want to work remotely and uh, have uh, your own uh, time or be your own boss essentially mastering design tools is going to be essential because uh, it's going to make your workflow more efficient and with more efficiency you can charge more by working less so this is actually something that uh, 
you want to keep in mind. So exploring design tools, which uh, mainly are going to be Figma for the very most part these days. Uh, Sketch also is uh, upcoming, but I would say Figma is not going anywhere for quite some time. And then learning some uh, other design tools, uh, which are going to help for image editing, such as Photoshop or its free alternative Photopy. And uh, when it comes to website design, uh, Framer and Webflow, these are going to be extremely useful tools that uh, you want to keep in mind uh, as uh, you work within your journey. And then we have entire chapters uh, about uh, user experience theory, but most importantly, the ins and outs of uh, UX, such as wireframing, prototyping, understanding uh, UX design as a whole. So this is going to help you understand uh, what are going to be the main areas that you need to focus on. And moving forward, I'll talk about uh, whether you should uh, learn how to code uh, or not. Uh, so HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and also how to build a portfolio efficiently and how to network because uh, those uh, essential blocks uh, are going to make or break uh, your successful entrance uh, within uh, this uh, field. So these are extremely important uh, and uh, there's also different ways that you can uh, tackle the learning stage. Uh, you can actually go ahead and uh, go through it uh, with uh, a full-time course. You can go part-time. You can also just subscribe uh, to some uh, newsletters, influencers, and uh, do everything uh, for free and self-taught. So there's all sorts of different ways. And uh, the question uh, really depends on what is going to be the best solution for you specifically, because depending on your time availability, budget, uh, there's uh, going to be a choice that uh, you need to make. So overall, uh, download the ebook. Uh, I'm super curious to hear from you. If you have any specific questions, feel free to let me know and uh, I'll uh, try and answer you via DM. Usually people ask me and students DM me on Instagram. So that's where you can find me and uh, I'll see you in the very next video.